the meta overall. Yeah. And, you know, I don't know if anyone has a real clear idea of what's the best at the moment. We've seen a lot of Shifu today yeah. as well. So uh, who knows what we're going to get. I find it really interesting. Well, first, fun stats. For Enter the Arena, which was the the really big tournament we had not too long mm -hmm. ago, pretty much the last thing you got to see my face in, mm -hmm. um, we saw every single champ except for Rygon and I think Pestilus. We saw every single champ. Oh, yeah, which is great. Rygon I mean, it's good yeah. to see that level of diversity yep. uh, in, in play. I don't know if we'll see that today, hopefully. Maybe we've seen quite a bit today. Yeah, we've, I, uh, we've, we've seen a good amount. Yeah. And it's funny to see Lucy come back. So originally, when you had conversations about what made Lucy really good, uh, was that Lucy, she didn't particularly excel at making any one person great, but she fit in almost any team comp. Yeah. Just because she has the utility. She is a little bit difficult. You have to be really good with her. Um, but let's go and see what they've got. Let's go. If we go into the game in just a few, yeah. a few seconds here. Few seconds. We'll be getting in. It is... Uh, we'll be getting in. Yeah. Yeah, we'll be getting in. Hey, hey we're in. Oh, look at that. Uh -oh. oh, hey. Oh, hey. Shoe size. All right, so... On slot. There it is, another Lucy. So, yeah, as I was saying, you see Lucy, she doesn't she doesn't make anyone really excel. So, prime example, what, what I'm referring to is you looked at Paloma Varesh, right? Old Varesh had like no mobility. Like mm -hmm. no, he had to use 25 he had to have 25% just to use his reform just to be able to move, right? Yeah. So, what you do is you pair him up with Paloma so we can just stand there, get healed, mm -hmm. take a bunch of damage whenever he gets in serious danger. He can get other side, he can get swapped with, and then he can also use his R. So, it made him a lot more mobile. So, Generally, Paloma was really good with people like Varesh, yep. but not always good with everybody. Now, Lucy, just kind of, she was just a jack of all trades. Yeah, she just, fit in anywhere. Yeah, she's got a Petrify, she's got a Panic, she's got a Clarity Potion, she's got some heals. She's not fantastic at either, she's not like amazing at any of those particularly, yep. but she's got just enough in her kit to be useful in almost any team comp. So I think yep. with the patch coming in and everyone trying out new Thunder compositions, Thunder. she's seeing a, re, a, a you're seeing a uh, reemergence. Yeah. A resurgence? A yeah, resurgence. Resurgence. Yeah. That sounds like a fake word. It's real. It's real, everyone. I promise. Well, here it is. Onslaught and shoe size is greater than maturity. That is your teams. And what a name on the side of shoe, shoe size. Shoe size. Numbnuts. Is Numbnuts. one of their players. I love it. Why am I not surprised? Oh, yeah. Ooh, good iframe usage there coming out uh, from King Mills. To avoid the Petrify, you see on the side of Onslaught, you do have ninjas on that Sirius. You have free what you saw on the Shifu and the Taya. Oh, oh. Like that. They are just trying to pin this fray on the corner. Oh, and the counter does not eat the banana either. We're going to see them just going together. Reap what you sow and ninjas being a monstrous duo right now following Stute. But he, two selfies posted in the middle. Three selfies posted in the middle. Oh, oh the double Petrify is going to come out. And they do get a Petrify then off. On to King Mills in the middle there. Counter is going to be procced, but that is going goes to be down no somewhere. going down. Ty yep. died somewhere. Oh, uh, there it is. There it is. The two of them showing up together. That's trouble. I know. I know. For a little while, we hadn't seen reap what you sow on. Uh, can't even think. Shifu. We hadn't seen him on Shifu in a little while. Uh, Shifu. Yep. Prior to the patch that just got came out, everyone thought he just fell off and became yeah. Rygon was lower kind of tier. The big, yeah. big melee pick. Rygon took a spot. Rygon got some hits because Rygon was just exceptionally strong. Such especially. good uh, self-sustain yeah. that he had. And, and then the double stun if he built into it. Yeah. And I think it was the round four battle, right? Or maybe it was round three. Um, but now we see, you know, Shifu coming back a little bit between Europe and uh, North America here. It seems like he's kind of, he's really cemented himself as, as the top melee pick yeah. again here. So, uh, you know, you're going to be seeing a lot of that today. You, you see a bit of Frey in there as well, but I think a lot of teams elect for the Shifu. Oh, they do such a good job of not fighting on that counter. King Mills is going to get punished for this. Uh -oh. The barrier comes out, but they shred right through it, and now Ninja's support. Nah, man, he's just going to do as much damage as possible. Two selfies Ooh. posted, no counters getting hit this round. Good job not proccing those. But they are going to run back into the middle here. Onslaught does get that orb. King Mills trying to cause a disturbance here and bloom up top is getting pressured by verse oh. heavily and he goes down oh that's trouble onslaught looking to go up two to zero in map number one in this best of three they are just getting melted see ya this does not look like it's got to be fun and ninjas so the thing that ninjas and reap what you sow tend to do reap 
he he just tunnels, right? Mm -hmm. He just looks at somebody, looks and, dead in the and eye. And he just like acquires them. He's like, "You're going to <laughs> You're be mine. Me. You are mine. I'm going yep. to own you, right? Going he does everything he can. You. And sometimes people do an okay job of kiting them. They've mm -hmm. used their mobility. Then what happens? Ninjas who just been keeping his eye on a di on he's everyone from a chilling, distance. Yeah. He's chilling. He's like, "Oh, space bar, <laughs> weaken, yep. boom, so, R, boom." He'll, have, he'll he'll reap, and it just gets nuts. Yeah. It's a, it's really tough. You get reap what you sow in ninjas on both of you. Look at this sweet angle. Look at this. Look at him Ooh. riding into battle. Oh, we lost him. Oh. Uh, it was almost cool. Solid effort. <laughs> a for effort, I think, as you say, Carpenter. <laughs> yes. Uh, Barrier's going to come out already from shoe size, and uh, Bloom has just been getting pressured pretty hard. Oh, getting crushed again. Getting caught inside the vortex, and he has nothing else to sustain himself. And now it's going to be reap what you sow. Going for the slice and dice, it is just, oh, it's a shellacking coming out from Onslaught oh, at the moment. I haven't heard that since ever. What the hell did you just say? The shellacking? A shellacking? Giving him a shellacking? What is a shellacking? Crush. Just, just face crushing. <laughs> that's, that's a just great word. Dominance. I mean, the word itself Ooh. sounds like an onomatopoeia. Yeah. Like, oh, like, and you punch him in the face. Shalaking. 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 Putting a little fanciness mm. on it. What about that croak life? Mm, yes. Mm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> We're starting already. <laughs> no, too soon. All right, right now, Onslaught just has full control. And this is when I have to disagree with the Lucy pick. Yep. Especially right, going against this say. composition. You yep. know what they're going to do. You know their job is to make you die as fast as humanly possible. They don't even care about the orb. We see what? Maybe one orb get taken this whole game? Now yeah. Bloom has nothing he can do. He finally gets the swift roll out. But now what? Now he's just going to get pulled again. And that's it. He's done. He's actually done. Yeah. He doesn't have enough help from his teammates. King Mills doesn't have enough CC with just his hammers. And Taya has to land the M2, which has a very particular range of when you land it. Yeah, it's... I, I agree with you. Lucy, I just don't think it's the pick here. In general, I feel as though your support pick is... And potentially something best saved for last, just to, because, I mean, for for Bloom, I feel like coming into this, Shoe Size should have had some sort of idea that Onslaught was going to be running a pretty uh, divey kind of yeah. composition to get onto yeah. Bloom, because they're they're just known for that kind of thing, especially Reap What You Sow. With Shifu coming back, you know he's going to be on that. I mean, look at this: 34 damage and 148 protection from Lucy. She had yep. no time to do anything. Five disabilities. Or disables. <laughs> Lucy, it's really it's really oh. difficult for her to do a lot of things. She's got a lot of disabilities. She's handicapped. She uh, broke a leg poor, in a war. Poor girl. Even uh. the clarity potion ain't gonna help that one no, either. No. Can't can't heal those wounds. <laughs> oh poor poor Bloom. Poor Lucy, I should say. I mean poor Bloom. Oh, hitting the counter right out the gate. Haven't seen that happen most of this game. Oh, oh my. Again. Oh. Taya. It. Taya has to try and escape. Bloom is up alone this time. Oh, King Mills just walking forward with his counter, and no one bites. Oh, the banana, too. Oh, oh here we go. Petrified plus the barrier, though. That's it. Tornado yes. was used uh, to, to keep him alive. Ninjas was getting pressured pretty heavily in the back. They were looking good for a little bit, but... Oh, we got one kill. Okay. All right. Oh, this might, yep, yeah, trouble. In cap, reap what you sow is just waiting. And there it is. Bloom in the 1v2, and these guys have a lot of health left. So I think that is, that's going to be said and done. <laughs> <laughs> well. Maybe she does have an instability. <laughs> Five of them, to be exact. <laughs> Five. Uh, <laughs> all right. Well, that was uh, not to use their own name. That was pretty brutal. I'm not gonna call it an onslaught. <sighs> all right. That's my one. Okay. You know what? <laughs> here's a little. Here's a little mini rant. All right. If you're gonna name a all team, right. name an org, name whatever. Mm -hmm. Don't name it a word that is probably going to be used. Yeah. While commentating. Like I could totally use that word as an adjective for what just. Or is that even? Yeah. The the onslaught. I guess that's kind of a. Well, I mean, I, I have no problem. I like the name. Onslaught's anyway. pretty cool. I'm. I'm just saying, I hate when I make bad puns, especially if they're accidental bad puns. I'm not even trying. And then I have to say, oh, that was an onslaught. The, the onslaught. Yeah, yeah. in the moment, the I, I, I almost just subconsciously called that an onslaught, and then everyone's like, LOL, bad pun, you're an idiot. 
Mm-hmm. And I hate myself. Yeah, I, I mean, Keep that's... Keep it, though. It's a, it's a cool name on song. I do like it, but yeah. I just hate myself. It's yeah, really just, what it comes down to. I mean, yeah. it, it happens. Yeah. That was something from, you know, the from previous Battle Rex. We, we've come to know that Carpet oftentimes hates himself. Yes. It's pretty sad. Mm. But there it is. Game one. Onslaught. Nah, he's uh, contemplating. Yes. Contemplating I, life. I imagine we're going to have quite a champ change for that. Oh, uh, yeah. Champ change. Chump champ change. Chump change. Chump change. Champ change. Champ change. Champ change. Um, but in the meantime, if you guys are, you know, I don't want to listen to these two guys. I'm kind of bored. Well, too bad. What do I do? You go to Twitter and you follow us at Watch NGE and you see all the fun stuff going on. Yeah. yeah. Lots of fun Including stuff. Including this show. This one right Boom. here. Boom. Mm. Mm. This. This one. This. That's quite the arm movement. This. This if whole If you didn't one. stretch before the show, that might have been a good I could have pulled. Could have oh. pulled something. Ooh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And it's... Uh, uh, luckily, uh, not pulling a hammy though. I'm a gamer. No. I'm not moving. Anyway. We don't, yeah. Well, that's the problem is because since we never move, when we do have to, like when it's, we do this, it's like that's a dangerous like, move. Yeah. Like that, that, that right there was a risky maneuver. Without proper warm up, it can be it can be dangerous. Mm-hmm. Very dangerous. But anyway, what what I mean, I think the big thing for me, at least thinking about the game, going into map number two, Bloom obviously needs to pick something that's not Lucy. Yeah. Right. I think the biggest thing they need is CC on their team. Mm-hmm. They really didn't have much. Yeah. I mean, you had Taya, who relies. She has her Q, right? Yeah. She has her pushback, and then she can maybe use her Zephyr with her EX. Right. And then if she builds into it, she can also get the wall stun, right? But that that's a lot of lineup in general. Yeah. Her M2, it is a little bit of a stun, but it's not something longer term, like a Petrify or an end cap, mm-hmm. right? Lucy has her Petrify, but again, requires energy. Yeah. And it's either going to get eaten up by a counter, or it's going to get... Just yeah, immaterial through, right? Yeah, or you know, you can yeah. just outplay it, dodge with with and, your speed. Yeah. And then Freya, she does have the end caps along the wall, but again, you have to line that up. You have to make sure you get static, mm-hmm. and then make sure you also hit a hammer. Yeah. No, like immediate, uh, like just no immediate. Yeah. What's what I'm looking for? CC. I or guess CC. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. Just yeah, value. No Not immediate like value. Right out of the gate. There you go. You know, so some some sort of a change. We'll see. I mean, you, you have options. There's, I feel like support at the moment is something that's a little more open. Uh, you can use uh, quite a wide variety of the support options. Yeah. I mean, I, in the previous patch, Oldor was really big. Oldor and Pestilus, you have those two options. I think they're still both really good. Mm-hmm. Pestilus, we saw quite a bit of play from today as well. He seemed to be up there with the Lucys in terms of getting picked. Um, so, you know, you can maybe go that route, depending on how they want to build their composition. Uh, you have options, though, regardless. You know, serious. I feel like every support at the moment can be used pretty effectively. like uh, Just about. Pretty, yeah. yeah, yeah. Pretty effectively. Obviously, Paloma, it depends on your comp, I feel more so. But, um, you know, you have options depending on what your comps are. So we'll see what change-ups they decide to make. You know what they could use? What? Probably Baco. Oh, yeah. That's yep. the key. You get it. You Baco. Have, you have your War Stomp. You have an in-cap. You've got mm. a 40 shield you can put on yourself and on everybody else. Juicy CC. You've got, if, mm. if, you hit, if you make a melee hit your Bulwark, it's a free stun. Easy money. You can, if you build it in the first battle right, you can snare them with your M2. Trust me. Trust him. He's always the best He's option. a professional. Yeah, I'm a professional. Baco. Yeah. Main. Main. Filthy. That's not that good. That is, yeah. I'm a professional mediocre Baco main. Yeah. I mean, that's... Can you be a professional mediocre? I mean, professional generally uh, means that you get paid, yeah, right? Yeah, but we, in esports, I feel like that term just gets thrown around for anybody that plays at the top level. That's true. I'm a top level. I'm a pro. Because I don't I think anybody playing Battle Rate right now is making a living off playing Battle Rate. They're not making a living, but they are getting paid. But they are getting paid. 500 to be exact yeah. for the team if they come in first. 500 for first place? Mm. Yeah. It's three something. You for got it. 300. Three. It's not three something. It's just 300? Yes. What about 350? Yeah, no. yeah, 300. All right, 300 for second. This guy's got bad math. It's pretty easy. It's five, I've three, <laughs> and then one, one. Really That's 100. Bad at math in school. That's $100. That's $1,000. That's 1000 That's our prize money. <laughs> Wow. Oh, no. Oh, okay. Bloom making the change. Is what we expected. And there it is. The Paloma. Um, hmm. I expect they're still going to, yeah, they're going to target her pretty hard. Yeah. Either her or Taya. But I, I explained this in the, or in the uh, EU broadcast a bit earlier. The reason it's like, who do you go for? Who's the easier target? You think when you just look at an immediate escapes, Paloma has two. Taya has one. Yep. But effectively, Taya has three because Palomas can also be put on Taya. So yep. she can other side her and she can swap with her. So that's kind of your, when you're deciding it, you could go for Taya, but you might have a harder time because she has her tornado and then Paloma can help her out. And then Freya, just don't, 
Just don't bother. Yeah. I, I'm not going to lie. She's my biggest weakness. I do yeah. not know how to deal with Freya. Yeah, I'm, I got to be honest. I'm not that good. I swear I, I do sometimes, and then I'm like, no. I, no I'm I done. mean, a good Freya. Oh, look at this beauty shot. Rush. Mm. Camera work. You know what that is? Look at those sick mouths. Juicy. Mouse. You guys see that cool, cor oh. no, cool, cool scorpion mount? That's the one we're giving away. Yeah. Look at it. Get a good look. Oh, march into combat. Oh, the transition. Oh, look at that. That was, that was oh, crisp. As the kids say, juicy. <laughs> as they say, as we say, as well. See if the composition change other plays out. Other for side is out. Here. Other side is out. But Reap what you sow. Does get the end cap. Going to try and follow through. Kim oh. wants to come help out. Oh. Oh, Bloom ended up right back in front. Out of the space bar oh. right in front of him. Bloom's positioning not ideal. Has to use other side. But oh, that's is, it. He's done for. He escapes. Goodbye, Bloom. He oh! Used... Uh, Never mind. Yeah, still nope. goodbye. Yep. Yep. Still goodbye. We're, uh, you're done. And there goes Taya. King Mills, last one left. This is trouble for shoe side. In the beginning, they did a good job. Yeah. I think I think I liked it. King Mills went to go put pressure on him first. And in general, Freya has a pretty okay time dealing with Taya. Mm -hmm. I mean, between the iframe on any, any big thing like the M2, any big nukes, uh, yeah. you can counter if you can, if you can time it correctly. And especially that boomerang is one of the more projected, kind of slower projectiles. Yeah. So you can time it right, get get the counter, pull them in. She doesn't get, and if you do it early on, she won't have her tornado because she needs energy for it. Mm -hmm. I, so I like that. And then Bloom is doing an okay job of staying away. But again, the problem is who's going to peel for Bloom? Yeah. And, and I think, too, one of the problems on the last round with Bloom is I mean, he was using his escapes. He, he, you know, he was trying to get out of there, but. I think the area that he, he spaced himself to wasn't ideal. He, he went away from the rest of his team kind of into a position where Onslaught could easily follow up on him. Yeah. I, I, he, he just moved away from his teammates, and then he was then caught out all the way back in, like, spawn by himself. Yeah. And then it was pretty easy finish for them there. Ninjas and Reap What You Sow can easily uh, just go and chase him down. So already they're on the back foot, kind of sitting towards spawn. Two counters coming out. Neither being procced. Nope. And now the end cap is going to land onto King Mills. But I, I mean, just right out of the gate, shoe size, I feel like they almost just backed up. They didn't need to. Now starting to move back in here. They are they at a health advantage at the moment. Yeah, they have a big health advantage. And now Averse has to deal with King Mills. Ooh. Ninjas might go in, but he does get kited away really easily by Num Nuts. I don't I feel weird saying that name <laughs> really really aggressively. No, oh, not a verse actually has to be careful here. We will see the EX space bar come out of Bloom, and that means all he has left oh. is the other side. But oh, does he have it left for his tie? Oh. He does! Other side just in time. Oh, but he's body blocking! Oh, beautiful body blocking! He's oh. still in it! The haste! He's just trying to get away, but the boomerang from a verse connects in the end, but they do get the trade. So it's one for one. It'll be a 2v2 here, but that whirling blade. And that Petrify on a King Mills, there's just nothing that they can do about it in the end. And uh, a better round coming out from Shoe Size. It's a, a little bit better, but still, it's not, not ideal. Oh, look at these sick camera angles. I know. That actually looked crazy. You saw that thunder strike. Not going to lie, that was nifty. 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 Thanks for being nifty, cameraman. <laughs> Done well. Onslaught. Now two rounds up. They have the first map under their belts. And remember, sure, there's some new people here. Best of three maps. If Onslaught wins this, they will be the first team to move on to our semifinals. In the meantime, there's another semifinal, another quarterfinal happening right now. We'll hopefully be able to keep you guys up to date. That's right. Very shortly. But for now, Shoe Sides really has to figure something out. They are just, they have to worry about it. They're, what is Bloom going to do? He keeps getting honed in on. They're, they're getting poopy dooped at the moment. <laughs> Pretty bad. <laughs> well, all right, there he goes. He hits the panic to keep oh. Reap what you sow off him. I believe that other side is available if he needs it. He's hanging on to it, but now is forced to use it. But this is when they're just going to try and I collapse. Hitting that panic oh. again. Bloom's doing a good job of keeping himself alive. But the problem is he's, he's not able to heal his teammates, really. And King Mills is, I mean, in dire straits at the moment. Use his counter. He's got nothing left. And he goes down to Reap what you sow. Now that's stuck in a 2v3 yet again. I don't know if anyone saw what Averse did. I didn't. Averse was in an M1 fight 
with Freya, which, I mean, obviously he has the advantage. He was hitting the boomerang just away from Freya. Mm -hmm. And then walking so that the boomerang came back to hit Freya. Oh. That way, no matter what, that he would never hit her counter. Because the boomerangs never hit the counter on the way wow. back. He did like three or four of them in a row. She hit the, she pulled the counter, and then he did it again. That's and then crazy. she canceled it. And then by then, he was just able to go straight for her face. It was actually the sickest thing I've ever seen. Top level battle right Oh, folks. my God. Top level. Well, it's three rounds to zip in favor of Onslaught. And if they win two more, they've booked their spot in the semifinals. So it's, it's go time for shoe size. I'm thinking they might not bring this one back. Onslaught just seems to be uh, just on a different level at the moment. But who knows, maybe they'll surprise me. Well, the counter does get hit. Oh, other side already used oh. by Bloom. King Mills has to find a wall to try and protect. The counter will get procked. A selfie posted up by Reap. It will not get procked. And now they're going to go in on a verse. Can they get some burst damage? They will. Nice chain CC. He's going to tornado out of there. And now King Mills getting body blocked. Oh, but the counter gets procked. They might find oh. the first kill here. The first hey. goes down, but the ultimate might take one instead. King Mills gets swapped. Oh, oh. good swap. Bloom, Broman of the day. Bro Broloma. The return of Broloma. Broloma. Here we go. Whirling Blade is out. Oh, good stun. He's trying to get out of there. Does hit that counter, and he gets other sided right at the end. And reap what you sow. He's only got eight health left. Oh, he's very hurt. He's getting some heals up and actually getting the in-cap, so he's able to get this. Oh, pulls Bloom in. Oh, with the with the spear. So now 1v2 for reap what you sow. Oh, he's done. Oh, they're laying it. Oh, that's it. Hey, they got around. Hey! Hey! Play. Shoe size is greater than maturity. Cue the confetti. Gets the first round of so far, actually, against Onslaught. Yay! They're doing well, though. So this is a team I really, I've seen, I've seen them around, and I know they're good. But again, we're going, we're talking about Onslaught. Yeah. Who the is the, the pretty much the best in the last America. we saw of them before Battle Rect went on hiatus? They hadn't lost in like two months. Yeah. Yeah, and it's apparently it's still going. It's just kind of on a different level, at least in in the North American side of things. It's I I suspect I'm smelling a comeback, dude. I'm smelling a comeback. Smelling it? I'm smelling it. Just shoe size got this. All the, I mean, a verse is their target right now, and if King Mills can go and get a decent amount of burst early on, and then hopefully their Taya Numbnuts will be able to capitalize, get a nice M2 on him. A lot of oh, not if Bloom uh -oh. doesn't die first. Yeah, that. Oh no, Bloom got away. Oh, not anymore. Oh. oh, but he's got the cavalry coming after him. Run. Oh, there it is, though. Some good burst damage from Taya. That, who's the center orb going to go to? It oh. Oh, goes to Onslaught in the same exact time that Bloom goes down. This is not looking pretty. And King Mills. Oh, that's it. King Mills is done, so. Oh, my. Well, that's going to be. That should be another round. Going over to Onslaught. And, and oh, the light and dark comes out. And there's the kill. Onslaught now with match point. And they're, they're definitely looking good to take it. I don't know if I'm still smelling that comeback. I want to smell the comeback. I want to. Yeah, but it smells kind of bad. <laughs> yeah. Not pleasurable. No. Would not. Would not make a candle. Shoe size. Out of that. Greater than maturity. Can they pull it off, or will this be the end of them? For Battle Rect in the quarterfinals, they've made it far, but is it far enough? Hey, at I least mean, they'll I get guess. a six scorpion mount. Oh, so many counters going unanswered. I can't tell if it's missed time counters or really smart people. Ooh. Oh, another one. Ninja. <laughs> Prox is. No one following through. And then he misses his R. Uncharacteristic of him. He does oh. get a weaken, though. King Mills is an adverse. Both equal uh, in health. The collapse oh. onto Bloom. He does manage to get that panic to keep him at bay. He's going to mount up real oh. quick. Oh, he oh. needs those greens. He got it. <laughs> Just in time. He stole the greens. Can it will it first die first? <gasps> they got to get a burst the here. EX. Get him, get him. Oh, Please. Please. will survive. Oh, they. Oh, my God. They just There's threw the it away. Bloom, at least kill him. Please. Do it. Do it for the homies. Get him, Bloom. He got yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he did it. For the homies. For the homies. Broloma. But that is Onslaught taking it. Five to one. They only give up one round in the entire series. Ten rounds to one. Onslaught just took that. Just to give you an idea of how good these players are. I promise if anyone were to run up against shoe size in the ladder, 
they'd have a really tough time. These yep. are top players, but yeah, they're good. It just goes to show the gap right now between them and Onslaught. Onslaught, such a strong team. They're yeah. a storyline we've been following for so long. Yeah. All the way back from when we saw the Averse Stro duo. Oh, yeah. And then they split oh, up and were on different threes teams. Stro, by the way. Stro. Stro's back. He's back. Stro's back. Oh, baby. Yeah. That makes me. Stro, Stro's my boy. That makes me excited. Yeah. Stro made old. Mm. Stro, you can't spell old door without Stro. <laughs> Uh, that's totally not true. Yeah, I. But it's, the sad thing is, I had to sit there and think about it for a second. <laughs> it's like Stro Oldor. Wait, there's no S. Close enough. There's yeah. an O in there and an R. Yeah. There's no T either. Eh, it's fine. Close enough. Whatever. Close enough. Close enough. Fine. Close enough.